Are you all, are you all ready? You're ready to go. Okay. Are you going to be sort of talking from here? Do you want to have my microphone? I'll give you my microphone. Um, a, a huge round of applause for the intelligent elephant alarm clock. <laughs> Who wants to go first? Who wants to speak first? You're, shall I hold it and then you can... Uh, Oh, hang on, I've got to get my clock out because otherwise I'll. Hang on. Let me just give you um, get five minutes. I see, okay. Okay. The intelligent elephant that never forgets to wake you up in time. Hi, my name is Emily and I. Hi, my name is Emily and I love animals and I am eight. Hi, my name is Charlotte and I love art and I am seven. Hi, my name is Maddie and I love dogs and I am eight. Here is our alarm clock. Features. Programmable alarm clock. Five different animal alarm sounds. Alarm starts with gently, then turns wild. Snooze the alarm using light sensor. Can read local weather information and wakes you up earlier or later. So if you want to get up, go to the beach. It will wake you up if it's sunny. Uses Google Maps traffic and transport layer API to wake you up in time to beat the jams and delays. This is our coding, how we made it. We programmed the alarm clock using Scratch X. It uses eternal hardware, a Pico board. We learned and used lots of pr programming ideas, including loops, variables, if-else logic. We used open data from the weather API and we'll use the traffic API. The kit, you can buy a kit or build it yourself. It could be a Raspberry Pi which you can control through a phone or computer. This is the Pico board we used which has lots of sensors. We used the light, the slider for volume of the animal sounds and the light sensor. The clock can be controlled through a phone app. We made the front page. This is this is the website we made all about our project. Development ideas. We have been thinking about lots of ideas. It could switch on devices like the kettle and make the heating come on so it's warm when you wake up in winter. It could text your reminders, like to take your umbrella if it's raining. For older kids, they could set it to wake them up if they want to do something like buy tickets for a concert or eBay bid. There are loads of things you could do. We wanted to help animals, so we adopted an elephant from the Rotary Club, which we have turned into a prototype of our clock. We hope you like it. The elephant will be auctioned to raise money for an elephant sanctuary for the Born Free Charity. If we sold the clock, some of the money could go to charity. Why we think it should exist? We didn't know much about coding before this week. It's amazing how much we learned. The clock would be a fun way for our friends to learn about coding and computers. And we, we all really, really want one. <laughs> wow, we. That is, um, that is the most intelligent alarm clock um, I've ever seen. And it's all been signed as well. Tell me, who's, who's been signing all this? We don't know. We, just random people. <laughs> Uh, I signed it. I just, I mean, I just, because I did. I, all, all sorts of people have been signing it. Well, that's great. Um, judges, what do we think of that? The, the intelligent elephant alarm clock. Have you ever seen anything like it? No, I think it's brilliant. You know, well, you know, good job, good job on programming that. Um, have you considered making your elephant as a miniature version? Because I'm sure not everyone has the space in their house for that. <laughs> did you? Did, have you ever thought about making a smaller elephant? Uh, yeah, and we did like we thought of doing like sizes and um, up to as big as the um, elephant we have there. So you have a little mini elephant, like sort of Russian doll elephants, getting bigger and bigger and bigger. <laughs> Russian elephants. Yeah. Um, any more questions? Uh, less of a question, more of a shout out to Horsham. Woo! That's that's hometown. Just, I'm so glad they have a centre this year. Um, <laughs> shame I couldn't be there. But get to judge. Yeah, awesome. That's already a small elephant, in my opinion. Um, <laughs> <laughs> elephants are a lot bigger in real life. 
Very cool. Any more thoughts, comments, criticisms? No, no, no criticism. not. Does, does it actually work? Does it actually, is, it, is it built in that elephant? Does this, does this elephant work? Is that the question? Yeah. Does that, yeah. Does, no. Could you, this, is just, this is just a sort of a mock-up, a sort of proof oh, of cool. elephant concepts. <laughs> yeah. And it's absolutely beautiful. I don't know if we can, uh, if you can, maybe you can have a look at it afterwards. It's uh, superbly designed. Did you have a lot of fun making the elephant? Yeah. What's it made of? Um, wood. It's, it's uh, sort of wood and sort of papier mâché. Okay, is that is that us for the questions yep. for the elephant ent yep. for the um, entertaining elephant? Love Huge it. round of applause for the <laughs> intelligent elephant alarm clock, guys. Thank you very much. That was terrific. Thanks.